This is Keisha, or Ekeisha, my pride and joy. She is my blue mane coon. Um, she needs a bath. Um, she is 12 years old. She was a neglect case. She was locked in a basement for three years. A product of a divorce. Um, one of the people getting divorced wanted the cat and the other one didn't. And the one who didn't took the cat to be spiteful, but then just locked her in a basement and left her there. I mean, gave her food and stuff, but you know, she had no real human contact for three years. And then he just was looking to get rid of her. My friend Stephanie found out about her. Um, she uh, was living in Boston at the time, and Keisha was in Rhode Island. And uh, arrangements were made for her to pick up the cat, and then I drove to Boston to pick her up. And she's papered and everything. She is not a social cat at all. Um, she's up here because she tolerates the cats that are up here. But uh, she really hates my dogs, and um, she really uh, would probably do better as a, a single cat household or a, cat, a household with only a couple cats, but she does okay here. Uh, as you can see, she's here at the big crate. This crate is um, its kind of like the kitty retreat. Um, if a kitty needs uh, to be... Uh, by itself, where you know doesn't have other cats bothering her or him, and I need to know if the cat's eating. I need to know if the cat's using the litter box. This is where that cat goes. It's it's a large crate, big enough for our Russian Wolfhound, but it's big enough for a litter box. And it's big enough for a little cat house, and it's big enough for food and water. And Keisha comes in here every night uh, just to eat. Um, She's locked in here while she has her food, her dinner. Um, I haven't fed them yet, so they get their they get special um, canned food they eat. Um, but uh, she knows that to come in here, and this is where um, she'll get her dinner. And then when uh, when she's done eating, she'll I'll open the crate and she'll come out if she wants to. Sometimes she spends the whole night in the crate. Um, this is the crate that Yuki was in after he had his little nervous breakdown. We covered it over with a blanket and he was in here for nearly three weeks um, before he finally, whatever it was that was uh, scaring him, finally reconciled itself. But that's, that's Acacia, my blue Maine Coon.